Hello. How's everybody doing today? Uh, today is March 2nd, I think. March 2nd or March 3rd. It's a Wednesday, so. Um, uh, how's it? everybody feeling through the, this energy? All this energy stuff going on. Pretty, uh, pretty intense, I think. Um, uh, the moon <clears throat> is uh, being chipped away more and more. Every day, and that's like I think that's what we need to be doing is chipping away at the the things that don't serve us, the things that are uh, <clears throat> a hindrance, a block in our lives. You know what I mean? Don't discount those roadblocks. And when whenever there's something there that that you just can't get past, there's a reason for it. You know what I mean? Maybe you're supposed to go uh, turn around and go the other way. Um, sometimes you know, sometimes they're there. To give us strength so we can crawl over them. But uh, most of the time, I, I believe most of the time the roadblocks are, are meant to stop us in our tracks. And uh, may help us to, to turn around. And uh, you know what? Spirit's got something else lined up for us. And uh, if we crawl over that roadblock, there might be a big old hole that we're going to fall in. On the other side of that uh, that fall, that wall. So, uh, let's... Uh, Take our time. Slow down. Maybe stop what you're doing whenever something like that happens. Uh, take a few minutes to meditate on it. Uh, ask the angels. Ask spirit. You know, wh or whoever you believe in, whatever you believe in that. You know, and get some answers. You know, use some discernment. Uh, let your intuition guide you instead of your your uh, logic. You know, sometimes our logic will screw us up, man. You know, so, uh, yeah, um, so today is going to be an awesome day, you know, there's, there's some things right now that are happening that are, that are causing me to say a few cuss words and, you know what I mean, but you know what, so what, it, 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 that's how you get through your day, if you got to cuss your way through your day, and, uh, then that, I do sometimes, you know what I mean, and I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Uh, it helps. It helps to to helps me to grow through certain issues. You know what I mean. And uh, you know, until I can until I can get to that point of uh, just letting that stuff roll off of me. You know what? It is what it is. You know what I mean. So I just think that uh, we're all on the right path. Every one of us is on the right path. You know, we got things to learn right where we're at. You know. So just fi figure it out, uh, what you're going through right now, you know, and those challenges, those things that are, are uh, you feel like it's a thorn in your side, man. Those things we need to ask questions, and, and what lesson do I need to be learning in this? You know, how am I going to get through this? Uh, how about some strength to get through this? You know, Cause life don't get easier. It doesn't. It gets, you know what I mean? If we don't learn our lessons, it just gets harder. We just uh, we just uh, gain the strength to get through those hard times. So it seems like it's easier, but it's not. You're, you're still dealing with the same old stuff. But when you learn your lessons and you go through it and you, and you figure it out, it gets easy. It doesn't get easier. You just get the strength to to uh, <laughs> to get over it. I, I guess you do. It, it does get easier because you get the strength to get over it. But you know what I'm trying to say. It's it's all the same. But uh, mentally and emotionally and spiritually and physically, uh, you're you're gaining strength to get over it. So in essence, you are. It is getting easier. I I guess. I it, you could think of it both both ways. I guess. Um. But let's uh. Let's do a, a tarot card. See what we got here for today. Another one of these. I like these cards, man. They're uh, a little bit shorter than, than these ones. Can't see it, can you? The light. A little bit uh, a little bit shorter than those. I'll draw draw one of these and see what we get, what we get, what we get, get. Alright. Uh, yeah, I don't know how thick those cards are. Uh, 
Oh, there's one right there. I think that's it right there. That's the one we had yesterday. Five of Pentacles. I'm going to put that one back in because I don't think that's what we're supposed to have. Maybe, huh? If it comes out again, then we know. What the, what the heck? Same card as yesterday? Are you kidding me? Not that one. Oh, we got the Ten of Pentacles. Oh, wow. That's pretty awesome, too. You see that? The little family. The dog. The little child. You got ch children playing in the background. That's pretty cool, I think. That looks awesome. What do you, what do you, what can you, what do you get out of this card? Uh, please like, subscribe, and uh, say say something in the comments and uh, give us your input on this. What what do you think about this card? I'm gonna read the read the uh, what it says, but uh, it is uh, the Ten of Pentacles. I'm not too familiar with with tarot. No, I just like to draw them because uh, they've been helping me a lot lately. And I, I'm hoping it will help other people too. And uh, so let's, let's see. Ten of Pentacles, huh? I'm seeing, I'm seeing uh, more of, more family around us. More uh, bonding with uh, not just our, our immediate family, but our uh, spiritual family. I see our tribe coming together, and I see that the the things that are being taken from our from us are the people that are not serving us. So we're we're coming together as a family, the a, a tribe. You know what I mean? That's what I see in that card. I see. Uh, yeah, I see that. That's pretty awesome, man. I see our family coming together. You know what I mean? And uh, I see us all uh, grabbing a hold of what we're supposed to learn and uh, having fun with it. You know what I mean? This, the energy that's coming up right now is going to be an energy of uh, joy, entertainment, fun. So uh, let's see. What was that? The Ten of Pentacles? Oh, I forgot. Dang it. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. All right, so 153. Eight of Pentacles, nine of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles. All right. It says the Light Seer and the Shadow Seer. The Light Seer is the, remember, is the uh, upright card. The Shadow Seer is the reverse card. So we we got a it's upright or it could either go go either way. I mean, just take it how you how you see it. All right, the light seer is spiritual and material abundance, community, generosity, wealth, and prosperity, building a legacy. The shadow seer is chasing luxury and status, financial loss, negative energy around wealth. Oh baby, this is the big one. All the love, abundance, and joy that you can mu muster in your heart is coming your way, and it's coming fast. It's time to prepare for its inevitable arrival and to commit to your long-term success. This energy is so big, in fact, that you should be pre prepared to spread some of it around generously. Bring an abundance of positive energy into your life and watch everything shift. Expect the arrival of success, happiness, and an upbeat and loving community as avenues widen and the right connections click into place. Our tribe. It's our tribe coming. We're, we're, we're gathering our tribe, man. That's, that's amazing. Remember that Perceptions change. You are one small move away from seeing the bigger picture and from unearthing a legacy of pinnacles that is already yours. You deserve this success and love. Taste the pleasures of life and embody a state of consciousness that says, Yes, I am worthy of all this success. I am successful and I share my wealth with those I love.
Can I get it in there? Probably not, huh? There we go. I am successful. And I share my abundance with those I love. And that, that perception, our perception changes. You know what I mean? The people that we think are going to be in our lives for, for you know, ah, they're going to be in our life forever. It doesn't happen that way, man. Uh, we, are, we will be stripped of, of the things that do not serve us. If, if we're ready for them, you know what I mean? And then we will, the things that are, that are supposed to uh, bless us and bring us uh, lessons that need to be learned and ways to prosper will come into our lives while the other stuff is being stripped away. So that's what I got from that. What did you get from that? What do you think it means? Say something in the comments. Uh, let me know what you what you think, and uh, please like, subscribe, and share these videos. I'm just trying to get get this get these out so I can help people. Uh, and hopefully this this video does help somebody. Uh, maybe it'll bring some peace, serenity. Maybe it'll, it'll show them what. Uh, they need to, to prosper in their lives, bring abundance, to bring their tribe, the people that are supposed to be around them. Uh, and people are, are brought into our lives to, to teach us what we need to learn. And that goes for everybody. So um, I'm going to get off here now. Love, light, and blessings. Love you all. Praying for you. And you are worthy. You are worthy. You're, and I pray and I manifest the right people into your life and the right situations and and. Don't discount them roadblocks, man. Love you.